What's going on guys? Today I'm going to be showing you how to add social media icons to your Gmail signature. So first things first is if you have a WordPress site, you can upload these the icons to your media files. So I've already gone ahead and uploaded these icons to uh, my WordPress media files. But if you don't have a WordPress WordPress site, it's totally okay. You can you're still um, going to be able to do this. Um, so the first thing that you're going to want to do is you're going to want to find some images off of Google, and these icon images are really tiny. Um, the first ones start at 24 by 24 pixels. And I like to use this size. Uh, if it goes a bigger one, is 36 by 36, and that one gets a little uh, a little too big for my uh, my like. So um, if you want to use bigger, totally up to you, personal preference. Um, but I feel that it's a, a little too large for uh, email sig. So once again, you want to find these images. Um, today I'm going to be using Facebook, Twitter, and YouTube and also a uh, my personal logo icon for my website so what you're going to want to do is you want to go into your gmail and this is the, this is the thing we're going to be creating is something like this where you have whatever you type here um, into your, the body of your email and then your signature has these linked uh, icons so what you're going to want to do is you want to come over here to this cog icon and you want to come down here to settings. You want to scroll down and go down to where, it's, where it has your signature. You want to come here. I'm going to delete these so I can show you guys how to do it. What you're going to want to do is you want, you're going to want to insert an image. And the image path is a URL. So that means that you can't... Um, you can't browse your desktop and um, link to a file on your desktop. Uh, it doesn't work that way. And a website URL is what this is right here. So what you're going to want to do, and this is where this is where the WordPress um, comes in. So I'll show you how to do it on WordPress, and then I'll also show you how to do it um, uh, through just a, a Google URL. So what you're going to what you're going to do is come over here to your uh, media library and right here I have my personal logo icon I'm gonna go ahead and load this up here it is and then you're gonna come over here to the right and this is the URL you're gonna copy that and you're gonna come back to your settings and you're gonna paste that in and as you can see the icon pops up right here you click OK and then to link this to wherever you want to link in my case I'm linking to my website um, you're gonna come right here to where it says link and you wanna make sure that the uh, your icon is highlighted so you wanna link the icon to my website and if it's your website then link to your website or if it's Facebook link to Facebook go ahead and link put that uh, URL in and then click OK and then there you go and you want to put a space in between each icon gives a little breathing room looks better um, so now I'm gonna show you I'm gonna do Facebook the Facebook icon but I'm gonna do it with the Google uh, URL so what you're gonna do again is you want to insert an image and ask for the image URL so you're gonna come over here and this is a 24 by 24 Facebook icon which is the same one that I have on my uh, on my WordPress uh, media gallery but I'm going to come here and I'm click view original image and then this is the URL that you want to copy so you're going to go ahead and copy this you're going to come into your settings you're going to paste the URL here and as you can see it pops up just there right there so as you can see that still works so that's how you do that and you're going to go ahead and do the same thing where you link it to your Facebook uh, you just put your Facebook link in here but I'm going to go ahead and delete this and put mine back on so I'm gonna go insert image come to my media go back to my library 
is my Facebook icon. Come over here and copy. Come back to settings, and voila, there it is. And then I'm going to highlight it. I'm going to link, and this is my Facebook page. I'm going to paste it right in there and click OK. And now that is linked to Facebook. Put another, f put another space in. Now we're going to do Twitter. So I'm going to come over here, go to library. Here's the Twitter button. I'm going to copy the URL, come back to settings, paste it in. There's your, there's your little icon. Click OK. I'm going to highlight it, link, go to your Twitter page. Control copy, come back, and put the URL in right there. Then we're going to do one last one, and that's YouTube. So we're going to come over here, image URL. Uh, that's not the right place. So we're going to come here. We're going to go to library. We're going to click the YouTube button. Come over here, copy the URL. Come back to our settings, paste the URL in, click OK. Highlight the icon, come over here to link, go over here to our YouTube channel, and paste the link in, and there you go. And you're going to come down here, say save changes, and then just as a test we can make a, as you see it uh, comes up right here, and then let's just send this to myself, test. Hello. So we make sure that those link to the right places. Come here. Refresh. Here's the email. See our signature, and there it is. So if I click the Facebook one, it'll go to my Facebook page. And if I click this one, it'll go to my website. So as you can see, that's uh, how you do it. Um, that's all for today. This was my first. YouTube video ever. I hope you guys liked it. Um, my next video, my next video will be showing you guys how to add uh, email signature um, to your Mac Mail. Um, that one's a little bit more complicated, um, and I'll show you guys how to do that next. But uh, definitely leave a comment uh, down below and let me know if you guys have any questions um, or anything I can improve on. That would be great. Alright, take it easy. Bye.